Bernie looks at us, kind of sits back in his chair, and he says, so we're looking for some new ideas for housing. I hear you got some new ideas. So we pitched the idea of the Community Land Trust. It met all the goals that Bernie had laid out. The approach of the Community Land Trust was permanent affordability. So the organization collectively owned land, but then could sell homes to individuals. It's a very sustainable public policy, and one might even say a conservative public policy because of the reuse and the paying attention to not wasting those public dollars. He pinches every penny. As mayor of the city, he found money. that There were surpluses buried in the city's books. One of the early surpluses, part of that was applied towards the creation of the Community Land Trust. This was the first community land trust in the country that was started with the initiative and the financial support of a city government. We were able to get a large amount of housing to be permanently affordable for people of modest means. The Northgate housing complex was 25% of the affordable housing in Burlington, and it was about to be sold to a private developer to be made into more expensive condos. He stood up to the developers of Northgate and said, not over my dead body am I gonna allow the displacement of 336 low-income families. If they don't have decent, safe, and affordable housing. They don't have a foundation from which to build their lives, the lives of their families. What's in it for the little guy? If you couldn't prove to Bernie that there was benefit to the little guy, then he wasn't gonna buy it. He wasn't gonna support it. The trust puts the land in. That's what's commonly owned. They provide a ground lease to the folks who buy the home. Two thirds of the folks go on and buy in the private market. They're earning enough equity. It's working for them, but what's important is it's working for buyer after buyer. We used to talk about the three Ps, protect, preserve, and produce. Protect the most vulnerable populations, preserve the affordable housing that already existed, and produce new affordable housing. We formed a national peer-to-peer -peer network called the Community Land Trust Network, and Burlington just became a model because of its strength. The legacy that Bernie left behind is that Burlington is one of the most vibrant, wonderful cities in the country. There are 20 Community Land Trusts now in Canada, 300 in England, 64 of the French version of a community land trust in France, and it's begun to expand to the global south. This has now come an international movement. It's nice to be exporting something positive from the U.S. It's very effective and very positive for communities to have this partnership with government and local citizens and owning their own housing, but owning it in a way that shares the value for the community. Three items on my, my wish list. More CLTs, bigger CLTs, and keeping community and community land trust. Well, the only way we're going to really tackle poverty is affordable housing. The only way we're really going to tackle affordable housing is through permanent affordability.